Hi, this is Yoey from Crankwheel, and this is a quick demo on how to schedule a meeting and use Crankwheel during the meeting. The first step is to create a meeting on your calendar. You can use any calendaring tool. I'm using Google Calendar. You could use Outlook or whatever other calendaring tool you, you like. Let's say I have a meeting with Jake. Jake, Yoey, one-on-one -on -one meeting. And I'll just go in here, edit event, and you see there's a description field here. Okay, now let's go to Crankwheel. As always, to use Crankwheel, we click the button in our browser, which opens up the Crankwheel control panel. Now down here, you have a button to schedule a meeting. So you click that, you give the meeting a name, it can be the same as the name in your calendar, and you say create link. And now this gives meeting instructions that you can take from here and put in here in the description for the meeting. If you're going to call the person, you don't need to include the phone conference details, just leave it as is. If you'd like to use Crankwheel's integrated phone conferencing, just click here to include the details for the phone conference. Either way, click copy, paste the copied text into your calendaring software, and then save your event. Now, if we pretend in the future that we are your guest at the event, they would copy the link or click the link in the calendar invite, which would cause it to open up in a browser. Now, if you haven't started sharing your screen at that point, it'll say waiting for the presenter to start sharing their screen. As soon as you start, or if you had already started to share something from your screen, let's say a program window, I'll share this one. Then it'll show your viewer a number that they tell you over the phone or in your phone conference the details of which they can get here by clicking on dial in info. They tell you the number and now you know which person to accept into the meeting in case more than one has tried to join. And now they've joined and they're viewing your screen. Anyone else who you invited to the meeting who has the same link will also show up in the box down here and you can accept them in. And that's how you create and use a scheduled meeting in Crankwheel. Thank you.